Hello everyone, this is William LeBoy from BMW of Cherryville. Uh, today I'm going to go over the explanation of BMW apps. So if you follow me, we'll get started. Hello everyone, here we are, so let's get started. Uh, before we do, I, I must mention uh, it's very important that unfortunately um, BMW apps is not compatible with uh, any Android products. So um, with that said, the only ones that, that are are the iPhone, the iPads, and the iPad Touches, um, or iPod Touches uh, rather. Uh, with that, let's go ahead and get started. The first thing we need to do is download two apps, one of them being uh, BMW Connected and the other one being BMW Remote. So we go into the App Store and download both of those, which I've already done. With um, with that, we'll go into our, our, our actual apps, our BMW Connected, which shows all the apps that we're uh, going to access and that I'm going to explain in detail to you. There are two ways that you can actually access your BMW apps from your phone. One of them being uh, inside your center console here through the actual housing here, this, this cradle, which you have to purchase the, the, the mount separately. Uh, and the other way would be with your USB cord that comes with your phone. Uh, plugging this in into your phone and into the USB port inside the center console here um, will allow you to access your BMW apps. You have to open it and once it's connected and the car is on, it'll start connecting. Once it's downloaded, we'll be able to uh, access everything from the screen through the iDrive. We're going to go into the main menu and we're going to scroll down to connect to drive, push down on that, and it's gonna access your, your BMW apps from the phone. And once they come up, they'll be right here and all, all of these different apps will come up. News, Facebook, Twitter. Uh, news is BMW news. Uh, it'll, it'll let you know uh, uh, what went on and it, you know, as far as any races, any upcoming races, any events BMW has uh, hosting. Um, the Facebook and Twitter uh, will allow you to uh, access your Facebook and Twitter accounts through your uh, iDrive. But for your Facebook and your Twitter, you have to log in through the uh, BMW apps connected drive on your phone in order to access it on your uh, iDrive. Once you're in here, it'll allow you to see all your messages that you've received, and it'll also uh, allow you to respond to them as well. Uh, we also have calendar, which you, any, any appointments or anything that you set on there uh, will show up on here. We also have uh, Wikiloco, which is uh, like, uh, sort of like Wikipedia, and it gives you a, it's a tour guide through uh, the location that you're at, the history of the location. Here, we'll, we'll go into it. Wiki tour guide and it'll load and then we'll say we want to go uh, through the location that we're at now. And it goes on to explain uh, Hartsdale, Indiana it was a town uh, in St. John Township, Lake County. It goes on to explain a, a little bit about the history here. If we go backwards, it goes on to explain this actual uh, piece of property that we're sitting on at one time was Saucer's Kitty Land. Uh, now it's no longer in existence as, as uh, the other kitty land is in as well. But it just goes on to explain uh, uh, a little history of uh, the area that you're in, or you can choose a different location. Uh, we also have uh, web radio, and web radio is a radio that will allow you to access radio stations from anywhere in the United States, or anywhere in the world for that matter. There's also another app that's called BMW Remote. That's a separate app that you would download. They're both free apps, by the way. What that'll allow you to do is be able to unlock your doors and lock your doors, uh, remote horn uh, and remote lights. So this way, if you lose your car in the parking lot somewhere, you're able to hit the, uh, the remote horn and it'll sound the horn. Uh, if you think you forgot to lock your doors and you're inside the, the store, all you do is go into the app and hit the lock button and it'll lock your doors. Unfortunately, I wouldn't be able to demonstrate that to you only because uh, you have to register your, your current vehicle with that app through BMW Assist and 
to show proof of ownership and everything in order to be able to do that. Well, folks, uh, that was it for the demonstration. Hopefully, I've uh, been able to answer some of your questions. Uh, if you do have any, any other questions or concerns, please give me a call here at BMW Sherryville or uh, stop on in if you like. My hours are from noon to close every day and Saturdays all day. Hope to see you soon.